Hello and welcome back. Um, today I will be showing you how to have your scratch sprite to be any size you want. For instance, if you are trying to make uh, something zoom in all the way to see something really small, and the, usually the sprite won't let you go in all the way. For instance, uh, let's go, say I have this scratch cat, and I want the size to be 1,000. So I'll change it to 1,000, but when I go, the max size it is is 540. And it won't go any higher. So, this tutorial will let you make it to any size you want. Um, alright. So, if you, if it's just one costume that you want to change to a different sprite, then that's fine. But, if it, if you want the costumes to change as as it's getting a super big size, then uh, it, it's it's possible. So, what first you want to do is click. Go. You can scroll down to the bottom, or you can go to the side and click my blocks, the pinkish thing, and click make a block. Here's the block title. Name it. Um, set size then you click add an input which is something you type in and for there say size now the size you want it to be will not be size size it will be whatever you type in there now click run without screen refresh that means it it happens instantly without any um waiting in between blocks like all the repeats would happen instantly for instance then click the blue okay button now you have this thing right here and it says define now what this what this is what this is doing is if you ever want to use this block you have to have a definition to it right there so first we're going to go to costumes at the top and click make a new costume which is just the cat at the bottom with the plus and click the paintbrush which means draw now on this one don't draw anything don't don't make anything at all just leave it blank um, because you do this because the the size of whatever you have varies on the, the max size for each sprite varies on how big the current costume is but the reason so so then what we're gonna do is put a Go to looks and put a switch costume to block, and switch costume to make it make it the costume that you just did. Then drag in a set size button, and for this, in the input there, you're gonna you the in the in the define block. In the mini block inside the block, there there is the the size input that you can drag out from there, and uh, this means that um, whatever the size input is into is whenever you have the actual block, whatever you put in here comes out right there. So, so then, after this, you're going to bring in another Switch Costume 2 and make it whichever costume you want. For mine, I'll do number 1, so it's the regular Scratch Cat. So, so what this is doing is it's making the costume really small, um, 
and then it's setting it to whatever size you want. And since the costume is blank, you can set it to any size. Then, it's changing it to the costume that you want. For instance, now, I wanted mine to be 1,000 size. Put in 1, 0, 0, 0. Then when I click it, it gets to 1,000 size. You can see it, this 1,000 size at the right corner. Um, and if I wanted to make him grow, grow to super huge sizes, then I'd put in a repeat. I'll say repeat 25 or 50. Um, and then, since, since this is only setting it to a specific size, it, you have to change it in a different way. So with a variable, you just put in a change variable, change variable block. But with this one, we're going to need to add. So when you have a... When you have a change variable block and it's set to 5, then it brings up a variable by 5, so it's adding 5. And in this, we're going to do just the same thing. So in operators, bring in a plus block at the top. And however you want big, you want it to change it each time, type in that number. I'll say 20 for me. And f currently, it's just setting size to blank plus 20. And it's just going to be 20 for the whole 50 rotations. So I'll go to looks, scroll down, and they have... Hmm. If you're having a glitch like this where you can't scroll down... Uh... Just use the sidebar thing. So you go to the size input and drag it out. Just like this. Now this is exactly whatever you put the size to um, under the project running. So right now, the size is 1,000 and it says 1,000 for the size. Then I'll put it in the empty space. So... Um, so what this is doing is it's setting the size to its current size plus 20. And so after it's the current size plus 20, it'd be 1,020. But then the next time it'd be 1,040 because it's adding 20 to the current size. And to make sure it resets every time instead of getting extra bigger every time I do it, I'll do a set size to button starting at 540, which is the max size, or it used to be. So if I run the script, it slowly gets big, it gets bigger from 540 to 1540. And so you can set things to any size now. If I set this to 50, let's say, then it'd get even bigger. But, just warning you, the bigger things get, the um, smaller they seem to be getting bigger to the eye. So you see, when I run this script, it seems to be getting slower at the end. This can be fixed by putting in or at least somewhat fixed by putting in a multiplication block. So I switched that out. Now I have size times blank. If it was times two, it'd get two times bigger every time. But I don't even want it to get a full times bigger. So I'll say, well, I do. I want it to be a bit more than what it already is. So if you do 1.1, then that means it's getting 10% of it and getting that much bigger every time. So now, it seems to not slow down and just get bigger a lot. 
And um, if you want your costume to be changing during this, then you can just drag in a next costume block. Or, well, let's see. I see. Um, for this, for this currently right now, you can't make it change costume while it's getting bigger. But after it gets bigger, you can change the costume, and it'll still stay the same size. Let me show you. So, after it gets all the way bigger. Then it starts changing costume. So if you have an animation and you want it to be bigger, then you can use this. And then have it still be changing costume. But you can't have it changing costume and growing bigger. Because at the end of this script, it's putting the costume to the regular Scratch Cat. Um, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Um, my Scratch account is called 279139, um, so you can put questions or comments there. Um, like and subscribe, and um, have a great time.